Hi guys, my name is Alex. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to use noise and noise plugin to create some interesting alphas which we can use then to create some models in Shadowbox. So let's begin. It's fairly simple. Uh, we just need a plain 3D. Draw it on the canvas. Click T on the keyboard and make polymesh. Then you have to go down to surface and click noise. Then this uh, noise maker window opens up and you click noise plugin and then you have here uh, a bunch of uh, bunch of options which we can use just to create some different noise patterns. So we're going to use this hex style for this purpose uh, and we're going to set it uh, 0, 07 and leave the rest as it is. So here you can uh, exper experiment uh, with these settings, different settings to get different uh, noise patterns. So when you have what you want, you just click OK and you can set the strength here and the scale. I'm going to use it something like this uh, and uh, click OK again underneath. So now that we have our uh, we have our uh, there. Now that we have our uh, noise created, we go under geometry and uh, Shut off uh, smooth, uh, smooth and divide it a couple times into like level 6. Then go down to surface and click on make mask by noise. Here the mask is created uh, on the noise that we made. And now we have to go down to polygroups. And under polish, we are going to set point to five and click group mask. So we get these uh, nice edges. That's why we set polish to zero to five. So now, if we click Shift F, we see that the model is uh, separated in two polygroups. Which, we, which is exactly what we want. So we're going to control shift and click on a polygroup so that it is shown and the other part is, uh, uh, is invisible. Then we're going to go up to geometry and we're going to delete lower because we don't, uh, uh, we shouldn't have any lower or higher subdivisions when we delete the hidden uh, polygons. So now we have this uh, model created which we can use it by itself. But it is a plane so uh, if we want to use it to make some uh, something similar but with depth we can make a mask out of it. So we're going to set a new size for the document. Are we going to draw it out again? Click T on T and keyboard, control and to uh, to erase anything that is not in edit mode. So now we uh, place it in the middle and go under alpha and grab document 
So now if we go directly to the so we now have the alpha created and now if you go to the shadow box and set it to 2, 5, 6 and enable it we see we control and click and drag to make this mask disappear and when we hold control and we click on alpha we will select the mask that we created and we are going to use drag rectangular so now we have to push control and focus shift on minus 100 and we are going to draw this mask on the shadow box and we immediately get this uh, nice model and then we are going to make it a little bit uh, wider so we are going to hold control and we are going to select uh, mask rectangular and we're going to draw the size we want. We're going to shut off shadow box and here we have some interesting uh, interesting model created with noise and noise plugin and then uh, convert it into alpha and use that alpha for creating this kind of model in shadow box so now you we can uh, export the alpha and save it for uh, our future projects if we want so uh, this is pretty much it I encourage you to uh, make some different settings under surface noise and uh, noise and uh, noise plugin just to create some different patterns and then use the polygroups to uh, delete the unwanted surfaces and then as shown, create alphas and use them for creating new models. This is it uh, for this tutorial, so till next time, enjoy. Bye.